let's look at another one. This one, there's no doubt about it. It's an absolute peach. Do you know where we're going? Yeah, Leeds. Leeds 3 3. You like this one? See the referee just behind me. So when I pick the ball up, I hear a, I hear a shoot. So I, <laughs> so I picked the ball up, I picked the ball up, took it out of my feet, and had a dig at goal. Ball finds its way into the back of the net. Anyway, about two or three minutes later, we, the sort of game's carrying on. And it was Mark Housley, the referee. He turns around to me and went, See, I told you to have a dig. <laughs> it was a referee who told me to have a shot. I was in the dugout saying pass, pass, yeah, pass. Yeah. <laughs> Your best goal in the Charlton shirt, that one? Yeah, I think so. I, I think my most enjoyable was the Chelsea one. I think that, that win and... I thought the one at Everton. The, away, the away Everton Ever. was a good one, yeah, the Everton yeah. one. But that, that was sort of the best goal, I think, I, I, I scored. And you've touched on Matty and his attributes as well, but what was he like to, to manage and have in the side? Look, when you've got a, when you've got a captain, you, you've got to, sometimes you've got to get the message across differently, not just on the training ground or on a Saturday. You need to get it across. And I, and, and I always used to use the captain as, a, as a, an opportunity to get stuff across. If I'm, out, if I'm unhappy about certain things, instead of me going full on to the players, slip in there, tell them it ain't, I'm not having it, and, you know, let them know, and, and that's the sort of thing I would rely on Matty to do. 